Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do your daily vibes for the 16th, January 16th. Wow, it's the middle of January already. Wow. So we're just going to see whatever comes up. This is the energy I'm picking up on for today. Keep in mind that the timing is fluid, so it could be in the near future, or it may not even be for you. It may or may not be. Let's see whatever comes up. We're going to get one of these for an overall energy. Then we're going to use this deck right here. What do we got for the middle of January? The, the smack dab in the middle here. What do we got? <laughs> A whole lot of excitement. A new vision, a new a new vision, a new beginning. I'm on fire. It's like a new spark has been lit. Full of it. Whole lot of passion. Hmm. Wow. What a what a what a way. What a way to start out the day. The world card too. We, you know, we have a new beginning here, and it's a big one. A lot of fertility, definitely. It's definitely a time of fertility, so be careful. I mean, if you're not looking to get pregnant, I mean, be careful. Um, <laughs> Things have been stagnant for a long time, but that's over. The time of there not being any action, the time of there not being any drive, you know, no drive, no action, it's over. It's over. Somebody's spark, somebody's fire within has been relit. And it could be because of another person or it just could be because this person has a new vision, whatever. We have a major new beginning here. The phase of your life where things have been like kind of uh, dead, over. That's over. Done. 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 That hermit is, oh, I thought it was the hermit. I don't know why. It's not, it's the Three of Wands, but I thought it was the Hermit because I saw the lantern. <laughs> what you've been waiting for is coming. It's like you've been looking at it, looking at it, looking at it. You've been anticipating it coming, waiting. He's looking through the telescope. It's like, we're just waiting for it to arrive. So it's like you've been waiting for some arrival and it is coming. It's coming. Literally. We have, a, we have a new arrival here. So like I said, we were talking about fertility. If you're looking to get pregnant, tomorrow will be a good day to try. Anyway, um, just saying. Something is arriving that you have been waiting for. Anticipating. The Seven of Swords. Hmm. You may have been refusing this, okay? It's like you've been cheating yourself of this arrival. It's like you've been cheating yourself of this 
new vision of this new opportunity you have. Refusing to see it because something had hurt you. Something had hurt you to the point where you were trying to protect yourself. Somebody has been trying to protect themselves by not taking any action, by letting their thoughts and their fears hinder them and really having their guard up, really, really putting a shield around their heart and kind of keeping themselves hidden. But it looks like they're not going to do that anymore. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready for this arrival. It's like there's a shift. Is that there's a shift from, from hiding and blocking to looking. Now I'm going to open my eye, make that decision to open my eyes and see what's coming. And it's like all of a sudden you have this, this big change or this new vision. Remember yesterday was a jolt. Isn't that funny? that wakes somebody up. It's like, okay, I guess I am going to look. I guess I am going to put myself out there. I guess I am going to get prepared and I'm going to go I'm going to see what see what's available. Hmm. Interesting. Very interesting. Ooh, and somebody is recognizing this is recognition. We talked about this yesterday. Uh, this is like a newfound confidence. Somebody has found their confidence and they've decided that they are going to head in a new direction. They've been, they've had some sort of success already. They've successfully completed one mission. They have one cycle, one chapter in their life has been completed and they can call it a success. It's been a success. They already went through the blood, sweat, and tears because now he's the victor. So it's like I, it's time for me to, to drop the barrier, to drop the guard. I've already won. Now there could be multiple, multiple admirers here. See, there's multiple admirers. So somebody has multiple admirers and there's an opportunity for a, like a new partnership. Now you could be meeting this person through the World Wide Web, the internet. This could have something to do with online dating. I don't know. I mean, because this is online, it can signal, the world is like, you know, www, that's what it is. So, somebody was not taking any action, protecting themselves, but now they have really seen the light. We got three lanterns, not one. All of a sudden, it's like, and he's got his telescope, he's looking for something. He's like, I'm ready, I'm looking, which, where is it? Somebody has decided, you know, they're really looking hard. And it looks like they're going to find something. They're going to find something. Because there's multiple people watching, admiring. Interesting. Oh, look at that shit. Double Ace of Wands. Wow. Somebody has cheated themselves in of a new beginning. No joke. We have a new partnership here. Two people are going to become one. I mean, they're going to come together. There may be a distance. They may need to travel because this is to each other. But this is, um, well, I mean, what would you call this? I mean, this is a flame. This is a flame. We got two of them. So two people are coming together. Whew. 
It's going to be quite a shock. It is going to be quite a shock. There's going to be an instant spark, an instant attraction. And somebody is going to open their heart and, and that's what's happened. Somebody has decided to open their heart, to give it away. I'm ready. I'm ready for love. Stepping into the unknown, not knowing, I, I'm going to allow. I'm, I'm not, I don't need to know. I'm going to surrender. Somebody has chosen to let their fears keep keep them hidden you know they've chosen to hide from the world but it looks like they're not going to hide anymore it's coming out of hiding it's coming out of that silence mode no longer going to sit back and be silent going on that mission did i mention that somebody is going on a mission Leaving, leaving their emotional sadness, loneliness, discontent behind. I'm, I'm leaving it behind because I want that nine of cups. I want that wish fulfillment. And the only way for me to do it is to leave, to leave this situation. Like I said, this, this could be, somebody could be traveling, literally traveling to another person. It could come to that. This could be, you know, there's a distance. There's a distance between these two people and travel could be scheduled or talked about because the attraction, the spark is so blatantly obvious that, you know, they can't not recognize it. It's recognized. It's very easily recognized. Yeah, somebody's moving. Somebody's making a move, a big one. They're traveling, like I said. It's an airplane, right? Well, that's a balloon, but it's an airplane. Same thing. Anyway, yeah, somebody is... I think somebody is meeting somebody over the web. I don't know who this is for. Or they have come together over the web. You know, Facebook's the biggest dating site in the world. I mean, it could be somebody in close proximity as well. It could be. Somebody has connected with somebody through the WWW World Wide Web, and now they're, they're moving towards each other. This is somebody, somebody's coming to the rescue. This, this somebody is coming to rescue you. So, yeah, we have somebody that is having an instant attraction with another person. It's mutual. There's a mutual attraction here. This is not going to resonate with every single person. This is for somebody. I don't know who. Somebody. Okay? There's an instant spark, an instant attraction that is going to really make somebody's heart like flutter it's like here it is here it is I can't deny it I can't deny it I can't deny the 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 way that my well what's the word uh, how I feel inside about this connection I mean this is a passionate passionate feeling with the two ace of wands it's like there's so much um vigor vigor you know excitement here there's just too much it's just so invigorating that i got I, here it is you know i'm ready i'm ready for it i opened my heart to it and all of a sudden it's like boom here it is 
And it's all because somebody took a new approach. The Ace of Wands is a new approach, and we got it twice. Look, It's like both of these people decided to take a new approach after protecting themselves and hiding for quite some time. Somebody has decided to come out of hiding, and it's like an instant change. What you have been getting prepared for, what you have been anticipating is like right in front of you. You can finally see it. It's like right there. And whatever, whoever this, these two people are that are coming together it is going to bring, it's going to bring success. It's going to bring victory. It's going to, it's going to bring balance and harmony. This person is going to help you. This is going to lead to victory and success. It really is. These are both victory and success cards. It's going to lead to a win-win. 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 It's like a win-win situation. Somebody has been waiting for this arrival. They've been waiting for this person to come into their lives, but blocking it for some reason. But it's like all of a sudden they, they wake up. They take this new approach, and there it is. Somebody is coming to the rescue, and they're going to help you to move on from an emotionally discontent situation that really hurt you. Wow, I can't even get over it. This is a, this is a soulmate connection too with both of these aces of wands. It is absolutely a soulmate connection. Let's get a few more cards. Now, the Ace of Wands is a just go for it card. Go for it. Go for it. There's mutual attraction here. The moon, of course. Of course. You got to face your fears. Step into the unknown. It is a mystery. It's a mystery. It is a mystery. But there's some, there's some hidden forces here. You know, the universe works in mysterious ways. This is something you manifested. Perhaps one of those nights you were talking to the moon. This is this is mentally trapped in your own prison. It's going right here. Somebody's fear was cuz this is fear was keeping them trapped and that's why they were blocking themselves from seeing, from opening their eyes, from even looking. Somebody was not even looking because they were fearful. Fearful of being deceived, fearful of being cheated, fearful of getting hurt again, right? Fear of being tricked, fear of being duped. But now it's judgment day. Now it's time to release. Now it's time to accept. That's what judgment is. Release and accept. Because we have an opportunity for An awakening, you know, two people coming together for sure. Resurrection, feeling alive again, rising up. Starting a new life. Somebody is about to start a new life. And it may involve traveling or moving. Because I see that.
somebody is ending a karmic phase in their life, it's over. And they're about to begin, they're about to have a new life. This is, this is a new life. It's time to release and accept. Release the past and accept the future. The future. So we have somebody that is like rising. It's like that phoenix rising from the ashes kind of thing. It really is. Okay. There's like a, a resurrection that is allowing two people to come together that are soulmates. Both of these people have went through a karmic situation that is now completely over. And it looks like they are moving on together. Together. Okay? So we got two people coming together here that are meant to be. These people are at a distance, though. I think they're at a distance. It's funny where I put the cards. There's been a lot of sadness, loneliness, and happiness with the fear that they've hung on to. There's been no growth there. And it looks like somebody has decided to wake up. So yeah, somebody has had an awakening and they have a new approach. They've taken a new approach and now they can actually see like a new partner. It's like there's a, there's a new partnership here. There is. You're not going to be, if you're independent, you're not going to be independent for long. You're not, if you are as totally single and on your own, you are not going to be single for long. You're ready. You're ready. And, and judgment, you know, if you think about that judgment, they see that, they see that, they see that you're ready. They see that you're, that you've got it going on and you're ready. You're ready. So what they're bringing you, they are bringing you what you have been waiting for. So for whoever this is for, somebody is getting what they have, wait, have been waiting for. It's because they took a new approach and they came outside of their fear. They stepped outside of their illusion. They stepped outside of their confusion and they woke up, did something out of character, and now... They have an admirer or several that is like, I'm, I'll come and get you, baby. That kind of thing. So, yeah, we have, a, we have a new passionate beginning here with somebody that somebody has met through the World Wide Web. And I don't know who this is for. It will not resonate with every single person, but it looks like this person may be traveling to you or you may be traveling to them, but travel is going to be on the horizon for sure because the spark is so big. The spark is so great. The attraction is so mutual. You know, it's a mutual, strong attraction that cannot be denied. Both people have it. So yeah, I feel like somebody has been stuck in an unhappy situation and letting their fear paralyze them. But all of a sudden, it's like that yesterday's was a jolt. All of a sudden, there was a wake-up call and I say, no. And this is electricity. It is. So it's like all of a sudden it's like, nope, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take that new approach. I'm, I'm going to do what I got to do. And boom, instant connection. Instant connection. So, yeah, I feel like if you are this single person that has done your work, it's, it's time for you to 
you answer that call. Somebody is moving on from being single. I mean, you can't, that's exactly what this is. Single, moving on to one to two. That's what's, if you have been single, and you have uh, made a made a different judgment call. You've taken a new new approach. You've released. You've forgiven. You've healed. You've accepted the truth. You know whatever the whole nine yards. You're single. You love it. You're doing great. Some you got a partner that's gonna come is coming to the rescue. I mean that's what's going on here. Coming to take you away. So that's what I have for today. There's some sort of new new spark. There is a new partnership. Two people that are so attracted and so connected to each other that it's undeniable. And they're going to come together. They are absolutely going to come together. And, and it's going to lead to victory. It is. It is. It's going to lead to victory and success. This is exactly who you've been waiting for. So, this is for a select few, I know. Maybe tomorrow's reading will be for you if this isn't for you. But I see that there are two people that have met through the internet. Or they have come together through the internet. And this is a, this is a connection that is undeniable. It's undeniable. And these two people are going to meet they're going to meet they're going to they are going to meet they're going to come together they're going to and it's going to lead to victory and success and that's what i have good luck